enjoying myself being a scientist again, just for a few hours. I've been one all my life, but to see how things have come on in the last, what, uh, 20 or 30, it was wonderful. And I talked to people I knew, I talked to lots of people, and they're all holding on to the importance of science. And I have seen so many changes. Uh, in 1947, we had the um, hottest summer and the coldest winter in one year. And those things make me um, you know, question the idea that just people could you know, screw the climate of the world up. If we wanted to double the amount of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere, we would have to burn all the known um, oil, all the known uh, gas, and one third of the coal. And we couldn't do it. We'd have to bring Arthur Scargill back to dig it up. We've just had the worst winter for, since 1963. And uh, it's a cycle. Well, I believe it's a cycle. So hooray for the cycles of natural climate change. The soils of the world have to produce 18 billion meals every day. And if science doesn't get their act together, how are we going to do that? And that to me is the, the number one. Number two is of course that uh, we are still chopping down rainforests, we are still um, clearing things for, to 